Acer. Acer is one of those top of the line companies for years. They used to help manufacture other uh, big time companies, uh, manufacture the parts for them. This has all the features you're looking for. It's got Intel inside, which is the boom, 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 boom. You know that you want an Intel processor, uh, a jumbo four gigs of Ram, which means if you're a multitasker, you're going to love that as well. You get 32 gigs of storage on board, but you can expand that. There is an SD uh, memory card slot on this so that you can also utilize that when you want to expand your storage. You have multiple inputs in those in this and Joe will take you on a tour of the entire thing plus because of the type of storage it has um, you're not gonna have to worry about battery life on this right which you know when you have huge storage and all that all these things going on and you've got uh, you know that the, the, the crazy traditional hard drive in there you're also gonna have a computer that's only gonna give you maybe two three four hours on your battery life jumbo battery life four five eight four seven eight Joe we only we have kind of a short presentation only 15 minutes today so I'm gonna let you jump right in buddy the great thing about having a Chromebook is, you know, maybe this is the first time you had a Chromebook or have heard of it. A lot of us guys, we bought PCs in the past or we bought a MacBook. Well, a PC is essentially a computer with a Windows operating system on it. A MacBook is essentially a computer from Apple with the Mac operating system on it. A Chromebook is the Google operating system. And when Google got into the market just about a decade ago, they said, we want to see what people are using their computers for. We want to be able to find and see and be able to calculate and see all the different types of technology that people realistically want to use that PC. And the easiest way to do it is with a Chromebook. Now, why is a Chromebook important? They designed it around three different things, speed, simplicity, and security. This is going to be one of the fastest systems that you're ever going to turn on. I'll show you in a second how quick it is because it uses virtually zero computer resources. It is so simple because a lot of us have been using Google programs for a long time, whether it's on your phone, whether it's on your tablet, you might have Gmail, you might have Google Docs, you might use Google Sheets, you might use um, Google Maps for sure. I use that all the time. And then Google Photos, that is a great, great program to be able to share all your photos, not only amongst all your devices, not amongst other people as well. And then like Guy mentioned, it's the security aspect of it. Because what Google did is they created an operating system that doesn't get any viruses, doesn't get any malware, doesn't get any Trojans. And that is so, so important because back in 2019, the number one way that people had their identity stolen was from the information you typed on your computer. So did you do your taxes on your computer? Have you put in your medical information on the computer? Have you put in your social, do your banking? If you get a virus on there, it can take all that information. But what Google has done they created a more secure environment. You never need antivirus protection again. It is incredible to be able to say that because I've sold over a million computers here at HSN, but it's only the Google Chromebooks that I'm able to say that. So you're getting an absolute secure, secure system. But when I talk about speed, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna come to hsn.com for a second because this is what Google, Google wanted to do. They said when they first came out with this operating system about 10 years ago, they said, we wanted to be able to instantly turn on. Now, when it instantly turned on 10 years ago, it was about 30 seconds, and that was so impressive. Right now, I'm watching the HSN live feed. This guy, when we were uh, talking about 10 minutes ago, I'm going to close this and put this to sleep. But then I'm going to wake it back up again, and then I want you to notice how fast it came back on, and now I'm streaming again. Now, realize 10 years ago, it was 30 seconds. That right now... That just happened in less than five seconds. Let me do it again. I'm putting it to sleep, so the computer's turned off. Now you'll notice the screen is black, the screen comes alive, and the screen is now streaming again. That is really difficult to do. Do you ever try watching a movie, and then sometimes it takes forever to get the movie started? Or it's a little pixelated because you have slow internet feeds? I just turned the computer on, went back to hsn.com, streamed the, the movie in less than a second. That's the type of speed that you get out of it. So back to the three key reasons why you want to buy this. You want a faster computer? Well, it doesn't get any faster than that. You want a more secure computer? Well, now you never have to worry about antivirus again. And then also you want an easy computer to use. Guy, when you have that Google operating system, it's all the same familiar icons we've used in the past from Google, um, the Google Gmail to Google Maps to Google Photos. It's all right there. So Guy, when you end up picking up a Chromebook, it is a different type of experience. However, you notice that it's a lot faster, it's a lot easier to use, and because it uses less computer resources, guy, this is the big one. This is a 15 inch screen, the largest Chromebook size we've ever had. This is not a two hour battery, not a three hour, but up to 12 hours of battery life. So it's really 
that computer that's designed to go the entire day. You, you know what it is? I, I think it's the perfect for computer for all of our customers. I really do. Because when you think about it, you know, I mean, if, hey, listen, if you want to go and spend $1,300, $1,400 on a computer, we got them. Go to hsend.com. We got them. I got every type of computer mm -hmm. you want there. Sure. Problem is, in today's world where we're doing a lot more computing maybe than we've ever done before, now it's kind of like, okay, that's this is something that, that you know what, I don't want to spend a ton of money on. This is something that I want to be able to utilize for what, for what suits me. So if you are an average user of a computer, you're going to absolutely love that. If you love to shop online, if you love that experience, uh, all the features that we talked about, that Joe has talked about, this is perfect for you. It's not overdone. It is perfect. And to me, uh, Joe, you know, one of the biggest deals that the reason that I went and spent $1,300 on a MacBook back in the day was because I didn't want to deal with antivirus. I was like, you know what? I want a you're system right. that's safe. And I think safety... Mm -hmm is probably the I'm top ready. thing that everybody looks for nowadays, even even over every other feature. You know, a lot of people, oh, I need more RAM, I need more storage. Most people want their, they just want their computer to be mm -hmm. safe. They don't, they want to make sure I'm that nobody you. is stealing from them, that nobody is monitoring them, tracking them, all those things. And when you buy this computer, Joe, you are protected. And that's a really big deal for folks out there. It is, especially because a lot of websites are a little shady. They're designed to try to trick you and fool you. It happens all the time. It's a billion-dollar business. They're not going to stop. But when you have a more secure operating system, you don't have to worry about it, especially this past year as my wife and I and the two kids, everybody was home. Everybody needed a computer. And sometimes my kids get online. They're clicking buttons here and there. With a Chromebook, you don't have to worry about your kids downloading anything because it is that more secure operating system. But when you think about why, the software, why would you use this, is that right now I'm using Google Photos. I love this program. Now, I happen to end up using an iPhone. I'm an iPhone guy, no problem. But what I've done is I download Google Photos. Now, every picture I take with my iPhone, guy pops up right here on my Chromebook. It's a free app that comes with it, and it's designed to sync up all of our photos. Because as great as a picture looks on a three-inch screen, man, when you see it on that big 15 yeah. six inch high definition screen it is a world of difference and there was nothing i had to do i didn't have to hook up my phone i just took the picture with my phone and it automatically syncs it automatically pops up it automatically appears right there that's just google photos now maybe you're into word processing google has a couple different options for you they have something called google sheets which is your documentation program that's already free and it's already included they also have google docs that's in there as well but then maybe you're a Microsoft Office person. You like to use Word, you like to use Excel, you like to use PowerPoint. Well, guess what? You can download those for free too. Because now when you go to the Google Play Store, I'm gonna bring it up here. If you've ever visited the Google Play Store and on the tablet or on the phone, you see that there's Microsoft Office on there where now you can download it right here. But this is the largest app store out of all the different um, app stores that are out there. There's over a million different apps and games and books and movies and magazines right there at your fingertips. So if you want to download Microsoft Office, you can do that. If you want to download Word and Excel, you've got that. But then, guys, it's also sometimes the entertainment, too, because these have become kind of boredom busters. A lot of us are watching movies with our computers now, especially when you have these great sound system. You have that great screen that's on there and that long-lasting battery. If you just want to get away from the kids and go sit on the back porch and watch a movie, you could do it because you can download Netflix. You can download HBO Max. You can download Hulu. You can download... Disney Plus, whatever subscription service you have, you've got it right there because you have access to the Google Play Store. But then have you ever played games like Candy Crush? Or maybe playing um, uh, some of the other games that are on here, the Roku type style games, all that stuff is available because it's the Google operating system. So guys, sometimes when people say Chromebook, they think this is too new for me. I'm not gonna be able to use it. If you've ever used an Android device, which is a, Google's operating system, Chromebook is gonna be the same icons. You see that Chrome operating system that's right there on that back side. It's the same logo, whether you're using a PC, whether you're using a tablet, or whether you're using a phone. Gmail is the same here as if you're using it on your phone too. So guy, when you get this at home, it goes back to the three key pillars that Google wanted to create. A faster computer, which the speed is gonna be, it's really gonna blow you away, I'll show you that in a second. But it also is about the simplicity. Things that are familiar to me, like the icons and um, all the programs that I've used on my other devices, but then it's the security. No antivirus needed, because I can't down download um, a virus, can't down download a Trojan or a malware, any of that scary stuff. And to show you the speed again, here I am streaming, uh, guy, this is our HSN live stream from about 10 minutes ago. As I close this and put the computer to sleep, how long does it take you to turn your computer on? For me, I'll turn it on, 
it'll wake itself up, and now I'm still streaming again. Guy, it's less than a second. Yeah. So it's that Intel processor, it's the operating system, it's all working together to give you that fast type of experience. You know, when you see Intel right out of the gate, you know that you're getting a good quality components that are put inside this, and that's what Acer does. Uh, and, and, and that's really the bottom line. You want, you want a computer that's reliable. You want one that's comfortable for you, that's familiar. I mm -hmm. agree with Joe 100%. I think for our customer, you know, I'm not talking about, you know, maybe somebody that's a CEO and has all this money and can spend $3,000 on a computer. Good for you. That's great, right? But a lot of us are just hardworking. We just want to get a great computer that performs for us. We want to do it in a safe environment secure environment. That's the most important. If you need a computer for your kids, this is a great computer for mm -hmm. them as well. It's not oh, going to sure. break the bank uh, at only 300 bucks. It's not going to break the bank, right? And you'll know that it's going to be safe and secure. So, uh, you know, their passwords and their social security numbers and addresses and all those things are going to be protected inside there. By the way, we are throwing in a bonus with this. If you order it today, you're going to get the um, the uh, flannel sleeve that, that opens up so you can keep it protected because if you take this with you when you travel, it's a zipper case. Uh, you just open it up on top and then you slide. You see it's padded on the inside. So all padded. So you're going to get one of these to go along with it, which will keep your computer nice and safe. How to pay for it. You can pay for it all at once or you can break up the payments. We've got it on three payments of 110. Try it out for 30 days. If you don't love it, you can always return it. But I think, Joe, as I said earlier, for our customer, it's really about safety and security, number one. For sure. Right? We've, we, we are the same when we go. But every time we get in the car, what do we do? We put a seatbelt on, right? We make sure we mm -hmm. use our turn signals. We go to the store. We wipe down Absolutely. everything before we touch it. We wash our hands. It, it's all about safety and security and doing the right thing. This is not going to break the bank. All right? If you can't afford it, you can always go to hsn.com and look for uh, items that are more affordable. But you may not get at Intel, you know, Intel is a name that you pay for. Uh, it's a it's a brand that you pay for, uh, a reputation that you pay for. So, honestly, you can't go wrong with this. And Joe, for this size, for a, a 15.6, which is the most number one most popular size, you're really getting a good good value on a virus free computer. But most Chromebooks, guy, to keep the price low, they end up being a 10 or 11 inch screen. This is the biggest Chromebook that we've ever offered at HSN, that 15.6 inch screen. But what's dri driving this whole experience is you're gonna see, you're gonna get a little Intel sticker on there because in there's Intel on the inside. Yes, there's four gigabytes with the RAM. Yes, there's a big hard drive. I'll talk about that in a second. But it's that Intel processor and it's the newer one that's actually a smarter processor. What Intel's done is they said, instead of just increasing the speed a little bit, let's see what everyone's using it for. Let's make it smarter so when you're online, you're doing less waiting. When you're watching your movie, it's gonna connect faster for you. Instead of just having a three hour battery, now we're gonna give you double digit more than 10 hours of battery life. So it's a more energy efficient processor. That's just the processor alone. But then when you do a quick tour of this thing, notice how thin this is. Guy, there's a lot of companies that sell air versions, super thin types of computers, and they add three or $400 to be able to say, well, you're getting the thinnest one we have. Look how thin it is. My finger is actually thicker than the computer itself. But you have multiple ports on here. You have USB ports, not only the super speed USB 3.0, you also have the USB type C for a lot of Android devices. You have those a couple on one side, you have a couple more on the other side as well. There's even an expansion slot. So if you wanna grow with this, you can even grow. There's HDMI if you want to connect this to a television. There's that USB Type-C that I mentioned. So overall, you're looking at four different USB ports that you can now connect. It does have a microphone and a headphone jack that's right there, but it also has Bluetooth connectivity. So if you want to connect to your favorite speaker system or your earbuds, no problem. You can easily do that because Bluetooth is built in. The other thing that helps make this thing so skinny is that...